Paul, in the third quarter of last night's Seahawks Detroit Lions game, I saw a tweet that said that uh, Cam Chancellor, when he's on the field, had not been scored on in 17 consecutive quarters, which is amazing. And of course, at the end of the fourth quarter, it looked like that streak was about to end. Well, it did, except Cam Chancellor is the guy who made a difference, and he punches the ball out of Calvin Johnson at the right at the goal line. Uh, late score would have put the Lions up. Who knows what would have happened? And then the conspiracy th theories start. Uh, KJ Wright bats the ball out of the end zone. Should have been an illegal play. Uh, and the official staring right at it, and he doesn't call it. So there's a lot of people saying the Seahawks are lucky, but they're 2-2. Two and two. They now go to play the 4-0 Bengals. You know, are the Seahawks back? It's an interesting question. Well, I mean, the Seahawks were that close to being 1-3. and three. Would that have essentially doomed their hopes of returning to the playoffs in the Super Bowl? I don't think so. I still think they're, they're a quality team. What it might have hurt is shatter that illusion of... of of them playing at home. You know, they are amazing at home. You look at how they beat the Green Bay Packers a couple of years ago with replacement rights. They do seem to get the bounces at home, and it's all about the aura of that team. They play with a swagger, and it pays off. Yeah, and it looks like it's paid off that Cam Chancellor's back in the lineup.